Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome here. Uh, my name is Bob Manley. I'm the new mayor of Verona. And thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, and it gives me great pleasure to be standing here with uh, former mayor Frank Sapienza. And we have Councilman Ryan sitting back in the audience relaxing. Uh, we have a beautiful night ahead of you. Would everyone please rise please, and join us for the national anthem? Uh, we need to thank a few people this evening, uh, kicking off our summer series concerts. Uh, first, we want to thank Wells Fargo, uh, who was our presenting sponsor. And we also need to thank uh, our friends from Unico uh, for the great work that they do for our community, the, uh, the altruistic nature that they have toward our community. Uh, Unico is a uh, private nonprofit organization comprised mostly of individuals of Italian ancestry and they're committed to uh, providing a better quality of life for those in need, not just on a community level but nationwide as well. So we thank Unico greatly and they're set up over there. Linda Gale is over there and my friend Larry and they have some red bags for you. Um, we have a number of concerts set up for you this summer. Uh, I, where's my list? Uh, next uh, Wednesday evening on the 17th, we have the, uh, the Greats of the 80s show featuring our uh, Verona's, Verona's native uh, Bobby Lynch. Uh, please come out and enjoy that. On the 24th, we have the B Street Band, a Springsteen tribute. And on the 21st, we have uh, <laughs> a lot of colada at the uh, Verona community pool. Some friends of mine. August 21st, did I say July? I'm sorry. So please come out and enjoy those concerts as well. Uh, but without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen, you are in for a treat tonight. Uh, so I invite you all to please just sit back and enjoy some of the purest, most beautiful voices you'll ever hear. Uh, Mr. Julian Hernandez, Mr. Anthony Tabish, and Mr. Ted Thomas. Ladies and gentlemen, the three potenters.
to see you guys. Listen, I found this piece of paper the other yeah. day, right? This is, you think we try this for the show? You mean right now? Uh, well, we can start. Let's start. Yeah, let's try. Yeah. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Caught in a landslide, no escape from reality. Open your eyes, look up to the skies and see. I'm just a poor boy, I need no sympathy. Because I'm easy come, easy go, little high, little low, anywhere the wind blows. Doesn't really matter to me.
some beautiful music and something I'm sure all of you have heard at least once or twice in your lives and if you feel like singing along please please do but you know in the in the uh, theme of tenor music that you might be used to hearing a night would not be complete without some of the music of Mario Lanza and here's Ted Thomas singing be my love something just a little more contemporary from the repertoire of that wonderful singer Josh Groban his Julian singing you're still you
you. At concert venues like this, uh, we, we pick and choose the program and, and it gives us great pleasure to pick some of the songs that we do because we wouldn't normally sing some of these songs for some of our other audiences. And even more so, it, it gives us a great thrill to sing together. So this next song is a song that you've all grown up with. This time it'll be in a different language. I think you'll recognize it. Solo piancero Lontano da te No stuff, huh? Should we do another one?
sights, little things I do. It makes me feel just like crying. something for you.
that one up, bro. Hey, it's pretty good. Oh, yeah. Tell me when will you be mine? Ladies and gentlemen, because you know, uh, singing these wonderful songs recorded by tenors is great, but it's always nice to have a girl in the band. But when <laughs> we decided to get together, we figured, now nah, let's just be guys, but we, we just couldn't do without the ladies. So close your eyes. We have a special treat for you. Close your eyes. Shh. Ready? Here we go.
did I say to myself? Come on, we're on the sing with Lewis, ready? Natalie Cole, Mr. Willie Nelson. How about Willie Nelson? What do you think, huh? Yes, I like this song. Mr. Willie Nelson, we enjoy with everybody.
around here. I mean, we, we did we did Mario Lanza. We did uh, some of the Italian tenors. We've done uh, the group Il Divo. We've done Engelbert Humperdinck. He was a tenor. Sure. There's another great tenor of rock and roll. My favorite, actually. Tom Jones. <laughs> what do you say? What do you say, huh? Theater has given us so, so many beautiful songs to take home with us after we see the show. One of the longest running shows was written by a French team. It's called Les Miserables. This next song, sung by Ted Thomas, is called Bring Him Home.
I might have known If God had granted me a son
It's another one of those songs that are in a foreign language. song to all the moms that are here, a beautiful song in English recorded by the singing group Il Nivo called Mamma, but this one is the more traditional Neapolitan Mamma that everyone who remembers Connie Francis knows, right? So here's Ted again singing the Neapolitan version of Mamma. <laughs> Felice 
we get another song from the sunny coast of Naples. This one is called Come Back to Sorrento. the audience to the opera. What do you think? Yeah, okay. You folks ready? Yeah. Okay. Now, you know the opera is just like the movies, except that before they had movies, they had opera. You know that, right? Right? So it's just for like people like us that were dressed in shorts and jeans, except they don't wear shorts in Italy. No, no, no. <laughs> no, no. But anyway, this were the common folk. They were stories, and the stories were set to music, and it took place in an opera house, just like a theater. So there was a composer whose name was Giacomo Puccini, and he wrote many famous operas, and one of his most famous was called Turando. Now Turando was the name of a character, a princess. She lived in a far off land, and you know how it goes with the royalty, they have to marry, but when they marry, they don't really get married for love, they get married for money and connections. You know that, right? It's like we do it here, right? All right, so anyway. Time came for Turando to get married, and she started to interview suitors. Now, she was beautiful, and she had a whole kingdom, so naturally there were many, many princes coming to see her. She really didn't want to get married, so she devised a way that would make things difficult. So she proposed a number of riddles to each suitor. Now, if the suitor 
was not able to answer the riddles, off would come his head. Bye, see ya. Well, there was a prince, also from a far off land, that was so enchanted with Turin, though, that he really wanted to marry her because he was falling in love with her. No one knew who he was. He came for the interview. She proposed the riddle to him, and he answered the riddle. He got it right. But he knew that she did not want to marry him. No way. So he turned the tables over. He said, listen, I'll give you another chance. If you can guess my name, find out who I am, then you don't have to marry me. Otherwise, I'll take the consequences. All right. Turando gives the order to her entire kingdom to find out the prince's name. You've got 24 hours. Overnight, none shall sleep. Nesum dorma, none shall sleep. Hence, the name of the most famous tenor aria that we know of, Luciano Pavarotti's signature song, and here's Ted Thomas, Nesum dorma. Sundorma, tu curia principessa nella tua fredda stanza. Us. This is our second time in Verona. Two years ago, we performed at Kipps Castle, a wonderful location. I wonder how many of you know where it is. You do? The rest of you, ask your neighbor and find out where it is. It's a beautiful, beautiful spot. Why don't you check it out? And uh, we're so glad to have uh, you invite us here. Well, we have a few numbers for you, but the, this next song, if you know it, clap your hands and sing along. It's called The Best of Time.
And this last song, we'd like to dedicate to all of those people that help protect the United States, the Army, the Navy, the Marines, the Air Corps. But not only those people abroad who keep people want to come to America, but those people here, our first responders, our policemen, our first aid workers, our firemen, our postmen, everyone. We've been traveling long without a home, but not without a star. Today of the United States of America. Today.